Okay now, it's winter time, I don't get out shooting very much, so I'm going to show you something uh, like a lesson here in my store. Now, I took a broomstick, so I want you to get a broomstick, just unscrew it, regular broomstick. This is how I'm going to show you how to take a stance. Take a stance in a way that doesn't torque your body. Any torquing is a mistake, so we don't want to be torquing our bodies. And we'll show you with this broom. Now, you can't see my feet or my lower body, so I will describe what I'm doing. But when I describe this, I want you to go and get your broomstick and do the stances I say. And you'll see what I'm saying will help you quite a bit. So, we don't want to torque. We need to look at the target and we need to find a natural way to stand. And this is how we'll do it. First of all, I always turn my head a little left. That gets my dominant eye on the target. Turn your head a little bit. Get the dominant eye forward. Now, when I look at the target with my dominant eye, so you're the target, the best posture that I find for uh, a stance is what I call the jabber stance, that is the boxer stance. So if somebody wanted to box and you wanted to do a jab, you would take your front foot and step towards the target. Look at the guy's nose, step towards the target, put your dukes up. This is a natural way to stand. I call it the jabber. It's a natural way. Your arrow is here, your bow is there. It's just like boxing. So that's the basic stance. Now, to get this stance, natural stance, because you know, if somebody said you're going to box, you'd never stand like that, would you? You know, you'd never do that. So let's get natural. Now, eye on the target. I will take a stance, or a step, towards the target with my front foot, just like a box doing a jab. That anchors my eye. My eye doesn't move, see? It doesn't move. I can, I can do all this kind of stuff, wiggle back and forth, but my eye will stay there if that foot is planted. So step towards the target. The next step is to put your dukes up. Now, if I, being right-handed, put my dukes up, you see the broom is pointing off to the side. So I lift up my back foot and I bring it around behind me. You see that? Dead on. Now that's how we line up to the target. There's no torquing in my body whatsoever. You see? So it's eye on, little step towards the target, Put it up in a natural position, lift up the back foot, twist around on the front foot, and you will go right into line. That's how you can line up very simply, very good, no twisting, you know, no twisting and twerking and all that kind of stuff. Now, another way of doing that is to first look at the target and put the arrow on. Now take your step forward, lift up the back foot, and bring it around to wherever it goes to keep that straight. See, if my back foot's there, that's no good. If my back foot is there, that's no good. Your body, if you lift up that back foot and just put it down, will find its own spot. It will find its own spot. You don't have to think about 90 degrees and do this and do that. Eye on step towards the target, lift up the back foot, swing it around. That's how you can get on, and that will help you quite a bit. Anyhow, uh, I hope you guys have fun. I want you to get a broom. <laughs> I want you to look at that target, take that little step forward, hold your arms up, swing the back foot around. Oh, and this is the other thing. Now, when you do swing this around and you get that into position, okay? I want you to look down and see where your feet are. 
Because if you know that's the position that you need to be straight all the time, you don't even have to do all the other steps. You can simply put your feet in that spot and when you put it up, it'll be there. So all these things are to teach you to look down and see where your feet are. That is your natural stance. Forget all this 90 degree and six inches apart and square and this and that. Just look at it, and when you're looking at it, your body will automatically line up. That is your natural stance. Anyhow, hope you guys had some fun. Get out there and uh, shoot as much as you can. Take care. Bye now.